What is going on folks? How you guys doing and uh, welcome to the uh, winter wonderland that is my backyard. Very snowy, not gonna deny that fact. But um, no, yeah, guys, I kinda feel like making a YouTube video today and I found some uh, found some clips that I kinda wanna show you. So I'm just kinda filming like an intro portion of the, of the video you guys are about to see, the quick video you guys are about to see. But um, no, yeah, I, uh, I kinda wanna show you guys a cool video. Show you guys a cool video that I filmed last year, to be exact. So anyway, we're just gonna we're just gonna go back to last year for context right now. Um, last year I stopped making videos around like I don't know like May, and I still did a ton of fishing. Um, didn't really film anything, but there actually was a small trip that I took at exactly like exactly a year ago today. So uh, December 26, um, 2019. I uh, yeah I took a trip down to the states, and uh, anyway I went to the states and I went to my uncle's, and my uncle lives on a golf course that has it's full of ponds. Anyway, I brought my open water fishing gear because I was assuming that there was still gonna be open water, but actually there was ice. The whole pond, the, all the ponds on the golf course were full of ice. And I was like, oh wow, well, that's kind of crazy. So what we did was we went to Dick's Sporting Goods. We actually picked up ice fishing rods and I went fishing on all these ponds that I did not expect to be ice fishing on. I expected to be open water fishing on. So I went fishing on all these ponds on the golf course. And um, no, yeah, I, I actually had some luck. I was probably fishing on an inch and a half to two and a half inches of ice. So it was pretty freaking crazy. I was like kind of risking it, but to be honest with you guys, these golf course ponds were probably only like three feet deep max, very shallow. But uh, yeah, no, I actually, I actually went ice fishing and I and I filmed some stuff. I didn't film a lot. I filmed very little, but I'm seeing that my ice fishing videos are doing kind of decent. So I was like, okay, you know what? How would I show show you guys that trip? So um, yeah, anyway, this is exactly a year ago today. Um, the videos you're about to see in this upcoming portion of this video are the clips you're about to see. Yeah, I basically put together um, a little montage of about a minute montage about these uh, all these fish that I caught through that the, through those golf course ponds on these like on this super thin, sketchy ice. Yeah, it was crazy. You'll probably see in a couple of the clips how thin the ice actually was. It was probably like, I'm, I'm telling you, maybe maybe two inches thick. Again, don't rip into me for not being safe. I was actually being safe in the sense I had ice picks on it as well. I was only fishing over three feet of water max. But um, no, yeah, that was, it was interesting. And I put together these, these montage of clips that I'd like to show you. So, you know, yeah, we're just gonna, this is, we're just gonna put them together. We're just gonna show you. This is gonna be a very quick video, but I thought it would be pretty cool. I'm sorry if some of the videos are filmed vertically. It was actually, actually what I did was I converted live photos into videos. Um, and yeah, they, they were vertical, but I mean, I do have some video clips too that I filmed that I were, was planning on posting on YouTube back a year ago. So anyway, yeah, we're posting them a year later kind of works though because it is it is ice fishing season so it kind of fits in the play anyway folks it's been a three minute long intro but i really had to explain what was going on there um it was it was a great trip last year honestly i wish i could have went back there this year but obviously with covid that's not possible but um yeah guys still i hope you enjoy the clip sorry if some of them are a little glitchy as well because it was a live photo conversion to video but anyway we're not gonna we're not gonna stick on that let's let's get right into this let's get right into the montage Tiny pond, one inch of ice, big bass. Goodbye. All right, so folks, um, that is basically the conclusion of this video. Now, obviously there wasn't much in it, basically just that little like montage kind of deal there. Um, you know, nothing too crazy to be honest, but it was a pretty cool video. I was pretty excited about uh, finding those clips because I was like, okay, yeah, like my first chain pickerels in, the, in those videos, first chain pickerel through the ice. I was very excited about that. I wanted to share that with you guys. And then uh, catching all those uh, all those bass for the ice is always pretty freaking awesome. Pretty freaking cool. They had some cool winter colors on them too. Very dark. Interesting for sure. 
But uh, no, yeah, that was that was me fishing in Danbury, Connecticut, exactly a year ago today. Um, you know, yeah, that was that was awesome. That was cool. That was that was freaking really cool. Um, yeah, guys, I don't really have much else to say in this video. All the fish that were caught in that video were caught on the exact same lure, a very small white tungsten jig tip with a wax worm. Very simple, but very like I don't know, very um, very popular way to catch fish through the ice. Um, yeah, super simple strategy. Super basic strategy, but yeah, that was what was pulling out the fish. I uh, couldn't tell you what line or what rod I was using. It was just a basic rod I just picked up for 20 bucks at the uh, local local Dick's Sporting Goods store. But no, yeah, the uh, tungsten and the uh, waxworm was the basic strategy, and uh, that is what caught them caught them all. Honestly, that that was that was basically it. The only ice fishing lure I had as well was that tungsten jig. It just it, it pulled through. It, it, it was pretty freaking awesome. Yeah, guys, um, don't got much else to say. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video again. Um, I enjoyed making it. I enjoyed going through the old footage. And uh, yeah, folks, um, I got some, uh, I'm just going to say, I got some ice fishing content coming for you guys soon. That's uh, this year. Um, my my last video you guys saw, I actually did go out on the ice. Unfortunately, I didn't catch anything, but you know, ice fishing videos are coming in really soon. And they're kind of, there's going to be coming in. There's going to be a lot. So I'm very excited about that. But uh, yeah, folks, I don't really got much else to say, honestly. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, yeah, I will, I will see you on the next one.